Let's do connections. We're finding four groups of four. We've got a school spool wax solar panel. I recommend making your solar panels not out of wax, they'll melt. All right, movie thread, honeycomb wind, laser ball. <laughs> Is that like laser tag? Wrap vitamin, coil spreadsheet, and organism pluck. Okay, so what stood out to me? A few things did. Solar panel, for example. Uh, two words is pretty rare for connections. Um, they've done it before, but let's see. Solar panel. So, I mean, there's not much to say about it. It is what it is, but what does it go with? Is it like things that go on your roof? Is it things that generate energy? I honestly don't see what it goes with. Green? Like, just in general, like, green energy? Okay, I'm going to hold off on that. Wax, maybe? Would wax go a spool? I'm not sure. Like spool thread and wax? I'm not sure. Or honeycomb? Okay, I just noticed wind. Wind can generate energy as well. Things that generate energy, wind, green energy, wind, solar panels, organisms generate energy. Yeah, I don't know. I'm going to hold off on that. Coil is interesting. Coil and wrap and wind. Okay. So these are ways of like, and spool, yeah. I don't know if it's thread specifically, but some ways of just like keeping thread tidy. Twist around, okay. It's as simple as that. Um, okay, so it wasn't wind, it was wind. It always confuses me. How about pluck? Like you can pluck a hair or you can pluck, pl what else are we plucking? Um, what are we plucking? I don't know. I'm seeing spreadsheet, honeycomb, and solar panel. I'm just wondering about them being like basically two words. Honeycomb, spreadsheet, solar panel. Hmm. I'm wondering about a play on words going on here. We've got organ. Organ is part of organism. Like, are we instruments? Doesn't really seem like it. Honey or comb, solar panel, spread or sheet. Yeah, I'm not quite seeing it. Okay. There might be something there, though. What about laser? Okay, laser, wax, and pluck, things you can do to remove hair. What else removes hair? Can you thread? Is threading a way of moving, removing hair? I feel like there's not another way. Sounds like something that might be true. Yeah, okay, remove as body hair. All right. Blank of rock, school of rock. <laughs> um, vitamin is interesting as well. Things that give energy, vitamins and solar panels. I don't know. What does organism go with? I really feel like they're, they're, they're extracting organ out of it. That's what I really feel like. But what does that have to do with anything else? Um, if it is something where we're extracting a word, it's these four. So maybe the, I can connect these other four together. School, ball, movie, and vitamins feel so different to me. I'm actually just going to try these four. I'm just going to try them. Yeah. Interesting. So it wasn't, it wasn't the purple. Things made of cells. So we weren't extracting things. Okay. Honeycombs, organisms, solar panels, and spreadsheets are made from cells. Okay. I got that right for the very wrong reason. I thought it was purple, and I thought we were extracting, like, words out of these and using those, which they often do with purple. So this is purple, School of Vitamin Ball Movie. Makes me think it must be a fill-in-the-blank, but I can't think what it would be. I feel bad because I basically lucked into it. If I can figure this one out, I feel like that's some redemption. I'm wondering if it's like vitamin A, vitamin V, vitamin C, vitamin D, right? Is, are, we, are we filling in the blank with a letter? Essential vitamin or like, but movie? Maybe it's not a fill in the blank. But what would it be then? I thought of home, like homeschool and home movie, but I don't think vitamin and ball work for that. Okay, I give up. <laughs> I'm sorry. I have no idea. No redemption for me. It's B. Wait. But you'd say vitamin B, not B vitamin, right? B ball, B movie, B school. This is the second time they've used B school for business school. They did it in a crossword as well. I've never heard business school referred to as B school still, except by the New York Times. So maybe it's a regional thing to New York. I don't know. Let me know if you use B school for business school and then vitamin, B vitamin. I would say vitamin B. I, can't, I think I've heard B vitamin before in certain contexts. Yeah, there's. <laughs> I did suspect it had something to do with just a letter, but I couldn't figure it out because I was trying to put it afterwards. All right, well, <laughs> I lucked into this. Um, how'd you do? 
Let's do the mini crossword for Monday, June 3rd. Let's go. Fezes and fedoras, hats. Trixie and blank, drag queen comedy duo. I'm not sure. Take in as a cat. Um, shelter, uh, home, I don't know. Vehicle for prom night, a limo. Aliens for short, um, extraterrestrials, uh, ETs. Okay, I have blank up to here. I've had it up to here. Tiny building blocks, um, um, atoms. What you might pass off a misspelling as, a typo. Took a chair, sit, sat, if you took a chair, you sat, and then hearty, leafy green, kale, oh, 49 seconds, nice. So what did I miss? Trixie and Katya, or Katya, okay, and then adopt, taken as a cat, adopt. <laughs> I do adoptal every day, and I still didn't get that, that's okay. Um, cool. You, you can adopt humans too, not just cats. <laughs> Kale, had it, Adams. Cool. I think I covered everything else. How'd you do? Let's do strands for June 3rd. Today's theme is better with age. Interesting. So what gets better with age? Like wine? Um, wisdom? Hmm. I need to find some words, I think. I'm not seeing a whole lot around the edges. What gets better with age? Both wine and wisdom need a W, and there's no W. So... Do chefs get better with age? <laughs> chefs? No. Okay. Um, teach? No? I thought that might work. Do donuts get better with age? I can't quite do donut. <laughs> Darn. Donut would totally be something that gets better with age. Right? Uh, I, I can't think what they're getting at here. There's a CK here. It makes me think maybe something uses that. Bucky. Does Bucky get better with age? Hacky. Just hack. Hmm. This KOM-ish area in this corner, it's interesting. I feel like I feel like we gotta come in with a CK like this. What would it be though? Okay, if we did do CK, what would the rest of this be? Like I I O M M O I Biome, clearly. <laughs> Biomes get better with age. Just buck. Just each, maybe? No. Is this supposed to be easy? Because I'm not getting it. Maybe trust? Uh, the problem with trust is that it, it leaves this IOM. So it's not right. Um, you can also do trust this way. So that's another issue. Um, hmm. What about this IOM? What, what are we doing with that? Like moist. <laughs> I didn't think that would be it. Moisture. Does moisture get better with... Oh, I spelled that wrong. Moisture. Moisture. No? Moisture doesn't get better with age? Um, toner. <laughs> I don't know what we're going for here. Clearly not what I've considered. I mean, if it's not wine or wisdom, I don't know what it is. Like, what are we talking about here? There's aged cheese. This is cheese here? I mean, I see almost... I almost see cheese. <laughs> cheese cheese spelled this way <laughs> um i see a few opportunities for cheese but but it doesn't follow through what else gets better with age just aptitude i don't know <laughs> what else do we age maybe kombucha okay is it fermented things do we have fermented ferment for fermented Okay, so I got it. So what else is fermented? Yogurt is. And um, kimchi is fermented. And what is this one? I'm going to try reef. I don't know. What, what is this? Kefir? I have not heard of kefir. Kefir? Okay, what else is fermented? Sourdough is. I don't think it's that. Miso? Okay. We have one word left that uses all of these words. Or <laughs> one word left that uses all of these letters. Um, sauerkraut. Right, how, are, how are we spelling sauerkraut? 
like that. Okay. Wow, I didn't realize sauerkraut had so many vowels <laughs> at the start. Okay, once I figured out it was fermented stuff, yeah, I don't know why kombucha of all things was the first thing I saw, but yeah, kombucha I do know is fermented. Yeah, I, I didn't realize sauerkraut. I guess I should have realized sauerkraut was fermented. I don't know what, what was it? Kefir? I'm going to look that up. It's a uh, Russian fermented milk. Cool. Um, I don't know that I'd want to try it. That sounds like it might not taste good. But, uh, is it one of those acquired taste things or is it good? Let me know. And of course, how'd you do? Mm -hmm.